In this video, we will teach you about two different types of, cir of electrical circuits and how to determine their values for voltage, current, and resistance. The first way in which voltage, current, and resistance are connected is in series. A basic diagram of an LED resisted in series is shown here. An easy way to visualize a series circuit is to imagine a river flowing in one direction and various components like rocks blocking the current of the water. The second way to wire a circuit is in parallel. A basic diagram of three resistors in parallel is shown here. An easy way to visualize the current in a parallel circuit is to imagine a river, but this time flowing down a mountain that forks into different paths of varying resistance. While Ohm's law can be used to find total resistance if voltage and current are already known, there is another way that this can be done. In a series circuit, it is as simple as adding each resistor together. It is more complicated in a parallel circuit, however. In this case, it is the reciprocal of the sum of each resistor's reciprocal. The equations for each are shown here. The easiest way to measure voltage is with a voltmeter, which is always wired in parallel with the circuit. In a parallel circuit, this voltage is constant throughout. The easiest way to measure current is with an ammeter, wired in series to the circuit. In all series circuits, the reading for current will be the same throughout.